Welcome back, everybody. I'm Doug with Maximum Wealth. Thank you for joining us today. We want to talk to you about a savings account versus the stock market. Which one is the best? Which one is, uh, is the worst? How, how do we look at these things and how do we determine uh, where our money is, is uh, in, a best, in the best place here? So what we're going to do is we're going to look at a 20-year period from 2000 all the way to 2019. That has been the last 20 years of our market. We're going to look at the S&P 500 because that's the truest measure of the market. And during that time period, we're going to use a 1% fee because you got to pay these financial advisors something to be able to do this work. So a 1% fee is fair. Sometimes they're higher, sometimes they're lower, but we're going to stay with the 1%. If we look at the 2000 to 2009 market, it was an actual bear market. So with that 1% fee, that is a negative 3.75% is how that market performed over that time period. You can go back and look at each year. But overall, that actual rate of return is a negative 3.75%. The next 10 years from 2010 to 2019, the market went up, and it actually went up 10.22% every year, 2010 through 2019. That is a great uh, return on our money. And it was a bear market compared, I'm sorry, a, a bull market, not a bear market, but a bull market compared to the 2000, 2009 bear market. Now, if you take that time period, 2000 to 2019, you have to encompass the loss years as well as the gain years. So overall, during that time period, your money actually earned only 3% per year. That's including the first 10 years of bear market, the second 10 years of bull market, but it all comes down to about 3%. Now, what would happen is if we put a dollar in that market, it would have grown to a dollar and 81 cents. That's the output of putting a dollar in this market over those 20 years. Now, if we had used a savings account and we'd put that same $1 in a savings account, with no risk, with no volatility, with no up and down, with no fees, that money would equal $2.65. Your stock market over that 20 year period, your dollar would be worth $1.81. In a savings account at 5%, your $1 would be worth $2.65. Looks to me like you've got more money in the savings account than you do in the stock market and you're not risking your money. That is a 46% larger amount of money in the savings account than in the stock market. I'm not saying not to invest in the stock market, but I do believe you need to have a certain amount of your money in a safe place, probably the majority of your money in the safe place. At maximum wealth, we believe in safety. We believe in protection. We believe in security. So if you are interested in those things, putting those seat belts on your money, putting that moat around that financial castle that you're building, if you want to learn more about that, visit MaximumWealth.net or hit the subscribe button to see more videos. I'm Doug with Maximum Wealth. Thanks for joining us today.